Hello, Eco Gypsy. Ah, it's been a while since I've been up here. We're up on the old campsite, or potential campsite. For those of you who watched the previous videos, you'd remembered us getting this stuck, getting this up here. So we come up today in the old TK, you get a bit of a uh, tree planting done. So the idea is to rewild some of this. I think rewild's the trendy phrase now. So we've got to put a hedge in across here. I've done some fruit trees and run a drive in. Believe it or not, we've done about 50 tonne in here. Just so we've got a bit of hard to drive on. Um, lots more to do. We've done some more down the bottom, which I'll show you in a minute. But it's a beautiful spot here. I've just got to get these in while I, um, while the weather's here. So for anyone who hasn't planted hedging before, this is how I do it. Got the old planting spade, which is a long thin spade. And just do a nice deep slit. Then we've got our bit of hedging. By doing the slits, you only have to then just heal them in without digging holes. Once these whips are in, what I do is get the cane and the very important half a tennis ball. Try and get them in as straight as possible. Cane's all in that. And then you've got your guard. We've got a lot of deer up here, so need this on. That'll just go over the top. And I'll try and get it into the soil a little bit as well. Um, you can uh, clip these on, but there's enough from cane there. and give it a bit of a start then and then we're offset another one this side and then we're going to put some of the laurel in and a load of fruit trees in here as well so my assistant is digging in the uh, laurel as we speak <laughs> yeah so canes in guards on Plenty of cane poking out the top, so if there is a bit of wind, they, they don't fly off. And then say we're offset each one by put another one in in the middle there, and then we're going to put some laurel in, and then some fruit trees and sort of miscellaneous. Really, we've got some apples at the end there, but we're going to sort of make this a, a quite a wide hedge and separating what's going to be the camping area. Very beautiful to the main field. So there we go, we've got a double row of native with the odd laurel in and then we're going to interdisperse this with fruit trees. Probably about this twice the width for this. Going around here along the back. Normally about three years before you get a good good growth but I've actually got to go all the way down to the road down to that oak far oak tree and then all the way along the end here till till there so there's a fair bit to do but we've done about 70 80 i suppose in about an hour so not bad for a couple of amateurs gonna be a lovely spot Anyone wants to come and stay for the summer, give me a shout. <laughs> 